Have you ever wondered how bamboo shoots are harvested and sold in the market? Bamboo shoots, the edible sprouts of the bamboo plant, play a significant role in the culinary world. They grace the dishes of numerous cuisines around the globe, adding a unique crunch and subtle flavor that is truly unparalleled. Harvesting bamboo shoots is a delicate process that requires a keen eye and a gentle hand. It's about identifying the right growth stage, ensuring the shoots are tender and full of flavor. This is an art that has been practiced for centuries, passed down from generation to generation. It's more than just a harvest, it's a dance with nature that yields a prize as delicious as it is versatile. So if you've ever savored a dish with bamboo shoots and wondered about their journey from the forest to your plate, you're in for a treat. Today we're going to take a deep dive into the fascinating world of bamboo shoot harvesting. Harvesting bamboo shoots involves a series of meticulous steps. It's a process that requires a keen eye, a light touch, and a good understanding of the bamboo plant's life cycle. Our journey begins at the break of dawn in the heart of a bamboo forest. Here, amidst the towering stalks, we're on the lookout for the perfect bamboo shoots to harvest. These are usually young shoots just emerging from the ground, still encased in their protective sheaths. They are tender and high in nutrients, making them a prized find. Once we've identified the right shoots, it's time to get down to business. With a sharp spade in hand, we carefully dig around the base of the shoot. It's a delicate task as we need to avoid damaging the parent bamboo plant and other surrounding shoots. The goal here is to extract the shoot without harming the bamboo's ability to grow and thrive. Next, we slice off the shoot at its base using a sharp, clean knife. Cutting it cleanly ensures that the shoot doesn't suffer any unnecessary damage and that the remaining plant can continue to grow unhampered. With our bamboo shoots now severed from their parent plant, we collect them in a basket. It's important at this stage to handle the shoots with care. Despite their hardy exterior, the tender insides of the shoots can be easily bruised or damaged, affecting their quality and shelf life. Once we've collected a basket full of bamboo shoots, we wash them thoroughly. This helps to remove any dirt or insects that may have clung to them during the harvest. It's a simple but crucial step in ensuring that the shoots reach the market in the best possible condition. And there we have it, a basket full of fresh, crisp bamboo shoots, harvested with care and ready to be enjoyed. It's a process that requires patience and precision, but the end result is well worth the effort. Once harvested, these bamboo shoots are ready to be brought to market. Whether they're sold fresh or transformed into delicious pickled treats, they're sure to bring a touch of nature's bounty to any table they grace. Now that we have our bamboo shoots, it's time to prepare them for the market. The journey from forest to market is an integral part of the bamboo shoot story. This is the stage where we ensure the shoots are cleaned, sorted and packed, ready for their new homes. First things first, cleaning. Nature, while bountiful, isn't always tidy. Our bamboo shoots are scrubbed gently to remove any residual soil or debris. This process is meticulous but necessary to maintain the integrity of the shoots and ensure they are market ready. After cleaning, the shoots are sorted. Bamboo shoots come in all shapes and sizes and sorting them allows for a greater understanding of their quality and value. The larger and more robust shoots, for instance, are often sought after for their hearty texture and flavor. Meanwhile, the smaller shoots are prized for their tenderness and delicate taste. Next up is packing. This isn't just about cramming as many shoots into a box as we can. Oh no, it's a careful process that plays a crucial role in preserving the freshness of these green gems. The shoots are nestled into boxes, ensuring they have enough space to breathe, but are secure enough to prevent damage during transportation. It's also worth noting that we take great care to handle the shoots gently throughout these stages. Bamboo shoots are delicate, and rough handling can bruise them, impacting their quality and shelf life. The journey from forest to market isn't only about the physical transition of the bamboo shoots, it's a testament to the careful, thoughtful processes that go into ensuring the shoots reach the market in the best possible condition. It's about showcasing the value of these versatile, delicious plants and the effort that goes into bringing them to your table. With our bamboo shoots packed and ready, it's time to head to the market. The bustling market is where the fruits of our labor come to life. Here, amidst the symphony of voices, haggling prices and the distinct smell of fresh produce, we set up our stall. 
A simple yet inviting display of our bamboo shoots, their vibrant green hues standing out against the rustic wooden table. We begin early as the first rays of sun pierce the morning fog and the market starts to bustle with activity. Each bamboo shoot we've harvested is carefully arranged, their pointed tips reaching out to potential customers passing by. Next comes the art of pricing. It's a delicate balance between ensuring a fair price for our hard work and offering value to our customers. As the day progresses, we engage in friendly banter with passers-by, sharing stories of our harvest and the unique taste of our bamboo shoots. Each sale we make is not just a transaction, it's an exchange of trust, a testament to the quality of our produce. The satisfaction we get from seeing the content smiles of our customers as they walk away with our bamboo shoots is unparalleled. But the market isn't just a place for sales, it's a community, a place where we learn, share and grow, meeting new people and forging relationships that go beyond business. Selling bamboo shoots in the market is a rewarding experience, but our journey doesn't end here. Aside from selling fresh bamboo shoots, another popular use of them is in pickled form, often with garlic and chili. Pickling is an age-old preservation technique that not only extends the shelf life of food, but also enhances its flavour. By soaking food in a solution of salt, vinegar and other seasonings, we can create a delightful tangy taste that pairs well with many dishes. To pickle bamboo shoots with garlic and chili, you'll need a few simple ingredients. Bamboo shoots, of course, along with fresh garlic cloves, whole chili peppers and a pickling solution made from vinegar, water and salt. Once you've gathered these ingredients, you're ready to embark on the pickling journey. The beauty of pickling lies in its simplicity and the transformation of flavours it brings about. It's a culinary magic trick, turning the ordinary into the extraordinary. Now we'll show you how to pickle bamboo shoots with garlic and chilli. Pickling bamboo shoots with garlic and chilli is a simple yet flavorful process. Now let's dive into the heart of it. First, we need to gather our ingredients. We're going to need some fresh bamboo shoots, preferably those we've just harvested. They should be firm to the touch and a vibrant green in color. Then we'll need some garlic, a staple in many a kitchen you can adjust the amount according to your taste. Next up, chilies. Go for the fiery red ones if you like a kick, or the milder green ones if you prefer a gentler heat. Once we have all our ingredients, it's time to start preparing them. The bamboo shoots need to be peeled and sliced. The slices should be thin, almost wafer-like, to allow the pickling brine to permeate them fully. Our garlic needs to be peeled and crushed, releasing its pungent aroma and robust flavor. The chilies, on the other hand, can simply be sliced unless you want to reduce the heat, in which case you can remove the seeds. Now, let's move on to the actual pickling process. We start with preparing our pickling brine. The brine is a simple mix of water, vinegar and salt brought to a boil. Once our brine is ready, we add in our prepared garlic and chilies, allowing them to infuse into the brine. After a few minutes, we add in the bamboo shoots, making sure they are fully submerged in the brine. Then, the waiting game begins. The bamboo shoots need to soak in the brine for a minimum of 24 hours, allowing the flavors to meld and the bamboo shoots to absorb the tangy, spicy and garlicky notes of the brine. The longer they soak, the more intense their flavor becomes. Once the pickling process is complete, we carefully transfer our bamboo shoots to a jar, making sure to pour in enough brine to cover them. The jar then needs to be sealed tightly and stored in a cool, dark place. Our pickled bamboo shoots with garlic and chili are now ready. They can be enjoyed as a spicy, tangy accompaniment to any meal, adding a burst of flavor and a unique texture. They're a testament to the versatility of bamboo shoots and the wonders of pickling. And there you have it, pickled bamboo shoots with garlic and chili, ready to be enjoyed at your leisure. There's something truly satisfying about harvesting your own bamboo shoots and turning them into a delicious pickled treat. Today, we've walked through the forest, harvested fresh bamboo shoots, sold them at the market, and finally pickled them with garlic and chili. It's a journey that not only connects us with nature, but also tickles our taste buds. So don't hesitate, venture into the wilderness and let your culinary creativity run wild. Thank you for joining us on this journey from bamboo shoot to pickled delight. We hope you've enjoyed it as much as we have.